Good morning, Mark. This is Joe Sabins from Vessi Motors. Uh, I'm going to do a video here of this 2019 Ram 1500 Bighorn that you're asking about. Uh, here's the front part of it right here. It is the Monaco red in color. Uh, brand spanking new, obviously, 2019. Uh, I'll do a video of the mileage on it so you know exactly what it has. You see the nice wheels on it. Here's the interior on this side. You can see the big horn part of it in the dash. And your power windows and locks. And here's the back side. Um, you can see there's quite a bit of room in the crew cab, obviously. And there's uh, plug-ins for the, your phones in the back. You can charge them or run your own music or whatever you want to do. Here's the door. You'll notice how wide the door opens up. Gives you a lot of room to be able to get in and out of the vehicle. Uh, beautiful stitching on the doors, make it look professional-like. Uh, rear side window from the rear. And then we get around back here. You'll see a dual exhaust. Uh, trailer tow, hitch in the back. Uh, both wiring is the four pin and the seven pin uh, big horn badging uh, backup camera uh, release you'll see how the tailgate comes down right nice you know it doesn't bounce down uh, there's no spray and liner in this one so like it needs to be washed out it's got a little bit of dirt from being on on the front line and, uh, here's the uh, passenger side uh, driver's side of the vehicle We'll open this side here so you can see it from this side this view you can maybe see the stitching and stuff a little bit better from this side uh, a lot of room in these crew cabs definitely the truck that i like uh, this also has the storage underneath on both sides you can open it right up and store it the tray inside comes out it's waterproof if you want to use it like a cooler or something uh, you can so this has the uh, smart entry, keyless entry. Uh, you basically lock it, put your hand behind here, unlocks the door. Uh, it's got the uh, automatic start stop. So basically what happens with that is uh, when you start, when you're driving the vehicle, we get to the light. It's not asking for power, the motor will shut down. And then when uh, you move your foot on the brake, it'll start back up again. Uh, saves on fuel mileage. Uh, it also has the folding mirrors. You can see that they go in by themselves and they go out by themselves power and power driver's seat with lumbar support the beautiful stitching in the seat again here uh, auto automatic headlamps if you want to use them uh, this is your release button for your parking brake plus uh, power pedals so you can bring those pedals out to you if you're a bit, a little bit on the shorter side so you don't get you know stuck behind the wheel with the airbag going off uh, cruise control on this side and Bluetooth hands-free communication on that side and your wiper here's your dash uh, 35 uh, degree uh, 35 miles on the vehicle gives you the temperature up here 34 degrees and the compass and which way you're going uh, automatic transmission four-wheel drive there's your off button for that uh, on off switch. Uh, in other words, the start stop. If you don't like it, you can shut it off. Push button, start. Nice center console, a lot of room in it. A lot of room, big room in this. You can slide this back, gives you room down in there. Uh, nice uh, holder for your cell phones. And then your uh, buttons in there for your phones if you want to charge them so up here is the sensors for the front and back uh, the beep when you get too close to something your trailer tow haul button so if you've got a load on it you can take it off shift it keep it from shifting up and down your traction control button uh, automatic brake uh, trailer brake already set in here uh, on the controls here you'll see you got the volume for the radio system the air, the heat controls, the fan controls, heated seats, heated steering wheel on both, uh, and then heated seats on both sides, obviously. 
and then your screen off if you want to shut your screen off see the screen nice 8.4 screen nice and clear you can shut it off you just touch the screen to turn it back on again uh, you can mute it as well so we'll turn this up nice uh, speakers in the air sounds really good um, you'll notice uh, it's got AM FM satellite radio satellites free for a year um, you can run your own media by running by touching this you can run your own media through there's no media available because I don't have a device hooked up your climate here's your climate control you can change uh, the temperature and everything the way you want it right now it's on high you can turn it down to low uh, passenger has a different side you can change direction where you want the heat to come out here AC on the back top high AC gives you the time air, the temperature outside uh, all these different apps if you want to have different apps here like your your uh, seat apps or your phone or your radio or climate or backup camera uh, that's what the backup camera is going to look like um, it will turn as you back up if you're turning something it'll turn for you um, then your seat controls if you go to your seat controls hot seat uh, uh, and steering wheel and obviously the uh, passenger side as well and then the backup camera now this has remote start so when you do a remote start and it's below 40 degrees your heated seat and heated steering wheel on the driver's side will automatically come on uh, the passenger side will not so you'll have to do that from there and then your phone system setup is here and you set up if you want to set up any of your language clock or anything um, the, I believe this vehicle, I have to double check it, but I believe it is also uh, has Apple CarPlay. So if you plug it in, you can run your own navigation off your phone into the vehicle. I'll have to double check just to make sure uh, that is available on this truck, but I think it is. Getting down to the nitty gritty here, it's a garage door opener, three of them programmable um, to the vehicle. And then uh, power slide me, uh, window. So your rear window is power slide. There's a the buttons for it. Plus the but, uh, buttons for your map lights and a sunglass holder. So obviously you can see, uh, again, the inside of the vehicle. There's your glove box. There's another one down there as well. Uh, really nice vehicle. So if you have any questions on it, you need me to redo the vehicle uh, video or something that you, I've missed, please let me know. And I'll get this over to you as soon as I can. Have a great day.